Hi, I'm Francisco Nunez. I'm the Artistic Director and Founder of the Young People's Chorus of New York City. The difference is, is what they can do with their instrument. So if you're a professional singer, as an adult, you're able to use your instrument in a way that's incredible. You can, the range is very different. The emotional capacity, the spiritual capacity is very strong. As a young person though, you don't see any boundaries. You're able to try anything and you're not afraid of it. You don't have the responsibilities of life that many adults have and, and the time constraints. So with young people, you're able to make a lot of amazing music. When I was still young, conducting with the Young People's Chorus in New York City, I was invited to perform with um, Master Jerry Schwartz here at Alice Tully Hall to premiere a new work by the composer Daniel Brubaker. It was being done over three times right here at Alice Tully Hall. And during one of the performances, a child fainted on stage. And it was kind of scary at that point. But the beautiful thing is that Marshall stopped the concert and, and took care of the child. Then we went on with the next movement. But uh, that was probably one of the most uh, uh, memorable times of performing. We've been to, I think, four continents at this point. So if I had to choose one place that we have the most ex best experience so far, it's been Japan. We've been to uh, over 30 cities all over Japan at this point. And, every, and we've been, I think it's our seventh time there. And every time I go there, I have so many amazing experiences from great music making in these gorgeous concert halls to, you know, tea ceremonies and, uh, and amazing food in August. Oh, that's a good question. Am I a cat person or a dog person? You see, the problem is, when I was younger, I loved cats. But I had a very small apartment when I came out of college, and my cat had hair everywhere. Eventually, I became very allergic to the cat. So I became a dog person. And today, I love dogs. But get me a cat, and I'll deal with the, I'll deal with the allergies for a while. I'm going to go back to my youth. One of the most influential composers of my life was Enrique Granados. So I probably would want to go back to Spain and sit down with him, and talk to him, how did he get all those rhythms and create gorgeous classical music? And maybe he'll bring my de fire with him, and we'll have a great little paella together. Alicia de la Rocha played, uh, I would go, it was either her or Mar Marcia Polini. So pianists were always one that I visited. Um, and I saw Alicia de la Rocha in concert right here at Geffen Hall, back then called Amy Fisher Hall. I could not believe what she was able to get out of the piano. Incredible. Yet I, I heard Paulini at Carnegie Hall and I had the worst seats that I could possibly have back then, way in the top. But every sound was like a pearl coming into my ear. It was incredible. Okay. Gummy candies. I carry them everywhere with me. So I'll share one with you right now if you wish. These are, oh, these are trolls. These are really good. Crawlies, do you want one? Mm. 